everybody what's going on my name is Jezza or Jeremy my real name is but no one ever really calls me that so Jezza for you guys anyway I'm using the intervention in Akimbo Rafikas for a free-for-all match on Favela and this match actually had quite a bit of fun on I managed to pull off a few cool shots I mean I'm don't take me for a great sniper or even a good sniper I suck at sniping I'm basically a camper usually and um, you might you know you guys might not like the fact that I'm a camper but I like to kill people and not get killed a lot and yeah <laughs> it's not that I don't it's not that I care about my KD I just hate dying it pisses me off <laughs> and this match I didn't really care so much about dying, so that's why I decided to snipe. And I actually had some fun, like I said, and me having fun in this game nowadays is like about as rare as finding a blonde virgin. Just just doesn't happen. I mean I try to have fun, but there's so many people that use crap perks and weapons that just screws me over. Mm, whatever. <laughs> but in this match I didn't really have a strategy. So there's no tips I can give you guys, and even as long as Modern Warfare has been out, anyway, there's no point of giving tips. Shit, there's so many tips and trick videos, it's nothing that you guys can't find already. So you can just watch the video and listen to my succulent voice and watch me take out these two guys right here, hard scoping. And <laughs> hard scoping, there's a few words in this game that make me just laugh. <laughs> Like hard scoping, that does. It's just there's a scope on the gun for a fucking reason. Use it. It's like, <laughs> like I said in one of the videos on my channel about quick scoping and hard scoping. Is I mean, yeah, quick scoping is. I mean, it can be useful, but hard scoping is for me a lot more useful than quick scoping. It's not like I'm gonna run around going hunting in real life trying to quick scope a fucking deer. <laughs> I mean, if for some random ass reason I kill the deer quick scoping that would be a fucking miracle <laughs> but no it's just like I said there's a gun or there's a scope on the gun for a reason and the role of a sniper for most games is to really stick back and you know just kind of give fire support and kind of call out where enemies are but you know that's not this game this game's a little bit more fast paced so you kind of have to use a quick scope every once in a while but for me like I do it a few times in this game only because I got lucky <laughs> but usually when I snipe be like on a team death match and I'll like on this spot like in favela I'll stay up here and just camp my ass off the whole time just picking off people and it's extremely annoying for the other people that play against me but I don't really care and right there I put down a claimer because I was gonna kill myself because when I called him my pavlo someone called him their harrier right after and as you might know or might not know, the Harriers will shoot down um, any helicopters. The TAC helicopter, Pavlo, and Chopper Gunner. So I didn't want my Pavlo to be taken down, so I was going to kill myself. And someone else killed me. And then I killed myself after I took it down, so I can go back to my sniping class. And then I still have a Harrier, but I don't call it in because I wanted to get... Or by the time my Pavlo went away... I was pretty ahead of the game, or pretty ahead of everyone else, so I wanted to get a cool kill cam. And as you'll see, I ended up getting pissed off and just calling him the Harrier to do the work for me. And then, right here, I hardly knife in this game. That was like a, I guess, I don't know what they call it, like a twitch or something like that, but that was a panic knife. I think knifing is kind of a bitch move. <laughs> and I'm glad that in Black Ops pretty sure the knife is going to be a secondary weapon so you know no one can just kind of panic knife and get you so which brings me to my next point I don't really have a point for this video except for this but on my channel I did a little update video kind of explaining the future of my videos and channels and stuff and as far as right now there's not going to be much of a future until Black Ops comes out just because I boxed for my college and they made me team captain, which is a huge responsibility for me now. 
I'm going to have to be taking care of all the new boxers and helping coach and stuff. So I won't really have much time to play just because I'll be like six days a week, four hours a day, plus school, plus my job. So I'm just going to be busy as hell. So I'm going to be, yeah, well, fuck, I just said it. So I'm not going to be posting too much. Um, I've very, rarely been posting on my channel. And I felt that I owed gaming label a video just because I haven't posted anything for them. Uh, the last thing I did for Game Label was the top five plays, which turned out to be a huge success. So thank you for letting me commentate over that. I was, I was kind of nervous. <laughs> Not to lie, I just kind of, I didn't, I've never done anything like that before as far as commentating over top five plays. I had to watch a few other people do it, like um, Only Use Me Blade on Hazard Cinema, Optic Hex for you know Optic Nation's top five kills, and Sam Five Thousand. Uh, and whoever else does it for watches gaming, but I think it ended up uh, going well, as far as I think. <laughs> but yeah, that's the last thing I post for gaming label. So you know, here's here's this little video for me, and it also kind of, if you guys like me on gaming label, kind of give you an idea of the next time I'll be posting. I guess I mean it might not be for a little while. So you know, if you miss me watch this video over and over so you can <laughs> hear what I have to say I'd probably get boring though anyway final kill right here here, here. oh wait right here there you go anyway 30 and 13 having fun sniping and that's it guys thanks